Hey, look at that. Barbecue for his daughter's birthday. You still going on about that? Let it go. Oh, I do like them fairy lights. Look at that sunset. The view from the balcony overlooking the ocean. How the other half live. What, what ocean could that be? Is that Atlantic or Pacific? On the west coast of ours? Uh, I don't know. Indian. Indian? Nowhere near Australia. Yes, love? Yeah, I'll just go change this barrel. Does that mean the battle's off? Oh, she won't be a tick. Sorry. I'm driving anyway. I'll just have a ginger ale if you've got one. Coming up. So, how are you? Me? Yeah, I'm OK. Mopping up beer all day. You know, living the dream. Sorry. I wasn't being nosy. It's me. We met at the hospital. Yes. Yes, of course. You... Your mother. That's right. Oh, we're just planning ahead. She's still with us. Good. Good. I'm really glad to hear it. And you? Yeah. I'm still with us, too. You had a scare? Yeah. Well remembered, but I'm fine. Good. I've been thinking about you. A lot. <laughs> I'm sorry? Daisy? Yeah? Yeah, how, how did you know? The nurse called your name out. Daisy Mitchley. That's right. Did you like your flowers? What did you think was going to happen? Oh, we made a connection. When I went to get the results of my mammogram? No. We exchanged pleasantries and, and sympathies in a hospital waiting room during a very stressful time. How did you know where she worked? Figured it out off my socials. Pictures outside the pub. You just know what Daniel's going to say about that. It's the boyfriend. Fiance. Bombarding her with flowers. Did you think she'd be flattered? Do you think she'd just jump into your arms? I know it's an awkward situation with Daniel, but you could just break it off. Look, things are tricky for you right now. I'm sure caring for a parent can take its toll, but there has been a misunderstanding. Was it you that kept calling her? Sorry? I how many phone calls from that number? Eleven. I don't have your number. I only sent you the flowers, the daisies, because of your name. If you were called Rose, I would have sent roses. I think it's best you leave. I'm free on Wednesday. Mum's going for some more treatment Thursday morning, so I shouldn't stay out too late. <laughs> You're not following, sunshine. Hop it. I hope things turn out as best they can for your mum. I'll keep you posted. Yeah, yeah, read the room. Yeah. She don't want to see or hear from you ever again. No more flowers. Bye, Daisy. <laughs>